Greetings, Feral family. Um, this is not the video you were expecting. Uh, um, the video that's going to tell you that we're not going to have the Feral family rosary together until after the new year. Uh, crazy as it sounds, um, with Christmas coming up and uh, priests' schedules having to change and everything like that. Uh, for instance, um, the Day of Reconciliation on Monday, which is confession from 4 to 8 in every parish in the Archdiocese. And then we're going to do a special one for uh, Monsignor Farrell High School, where, uh, where I'll be available on Tuesday as well, 4 to 8, for those students who weren't, who weren't able to go on Monday. Um, and then school is ending the next day, and then we're at Christmas Eve. So school will be out until January 4th. Um, which means this is our last feral, yesterday, or yeah, yesterday was the last feral family of the year. Oh, yeah, yeah, wow. Where does the time go when you're having fun? Uh, in all seriousness, um, it's sad that we're not going to get to have another one in public, but uh, it's been great praying with you this year, uh, getting ready for Christmas, enjoying this Advent time together. Um, so spend this time, of course, keep praying the rosary every day, especially because during this year of St. Joseph, um, the Holy Father has given a plenary indulgence for families who uh, pray the rosary together and especially engaged couples. Um, this is uh, kind of an added impetus during this year of St. Joseph to meditate on uh, Mary and her child and Joseph who took care of them and uh the church is emphasizing that this is such a great thing to do and the rosary being such a great prayer. Uh, be on the lookout for other ways to get a plenary indulgence this year, which is, includes praying the litany of St. Joseph each day, offering your work to St. Joseph at the beginning of each day, um, praying to St. Joseph for work, for a job, um, doing any of the works of mercy, which is kind of insane, because we do that all day long, all the time. So any of the 14 works of mercy, both corporal and spiritual, uh, those can be plenary indulgences. So each and every day we should be really spiritually gain gaining many graces. So basically if you're going to confession like every two weeks, uh, two or three weeks, and you're going to mass every Sunday and offering up those communions and those confessions, and then doing these practices, um, really we should be ready for heaven and gaining much merit for heaven and um, really helping other people along the way. So this is what we do now. Uh, turn your attention to these things. Learn more about the year of St. Joseph. If you haven't already, consecrate yourself to Mary through Father Gately's day, 33 days of morning glory. Consecrate yourself to St. Joseph with Father Calloway's book, Consecration to St. Joseph, and put up a beautiful picture of the Sacred Heart uh, in your home and the Immaculate Heart as well, and a picture of St. Joseph alongside them. Um, feel free even to leave your crush up throughout the year this year. Um, good excuse to leave up the Christmas lights and the Christmas crush. Uh, just in honor of St. Joseph and the Holy Family this year. So without further ado, of course, keep praying the rosary. I'll be praying for you and with you. I'll see you again on January 4th. I wish you all a very Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year. God bless you all.